This man is a pure coward. He busted up their TV, yelled, screamed, threatened, and assaulted the mother of his child. And to top it off, he did all of that in front of his child. And looking at the video in the room that they are staying in, it seems like he wasn't even man enough to get his family their own place. Seems like this Kang is living off the mother of his child and her family. This sick degenerate culture of dusty worship sets up black women and preferences to be hurt, abused, and unalived. I don't know what this preference was thinking. This man is not mad enough to get you your own place. He throws tantrums like your child. Break shit he can't afford to buy like your child. Screams and yells and threatens you in your face in front of your child. And if you don't leave him and take your child away, one day he will greatly harm you and your child. But hey, y'all choose these kingdomless kings. Y'all choose these dusty bums that can't offer you shit. And you end up taking care of not only him, but the children. While he stays at home playing a PlayStation you bought in your parents' house. Eating your kids' fruit snacks with your kid. While your dumbass is going to work to provide for them all. Because believe it or not, at this point, you're a single mother. Even though that Dusty is still laying up beside you. You're a single mother because you're taking care of him and your children by yourself. And now you have to go buy a new TV because you know damn well he don't have any money to replace that. These kingdomless kings seem to be more trouble than they're worth. And new preferences are starting to quickly understand one fathomless truth. That you don't get any special treatment. That you get the same dusty degenerate kang that black women get. You're not special. Despite all the gaslighting and all the bashing they do of their own women. You're just a fetish.